Growing your own food is a great way to save money and be green. And not to mention the vegetables are fresh when they hit your table. But this summer, I want to quadruple the size of my garden. Now I'm relatively new to gardening, so I started small. Last summer, I grew tomatoes and green peppers in this small raised bed. But I'm going to build three more beds just like this one. And to one of them, I'm going to add a creative feature that's going to aid watering, especially the, the deep watering that green peppers love. First, we'll measure and cut our boards. You'll notice I'm using reclaimed lumber from a deck that my neighbor took down. I'm using a couple robust nails to secure each corner and I'm building the frames on a flat surface to help keep them square. Make sure you install your garden beds on a flat surface or level them. This bed will have the underground watering pipe. I'll start by marking it out, clearing, and then digging the trench for the pipe. I'm using four inch perforated drain pipe, which I'll wrap with weed block to prevent soil from infiltrating in. Once the pipe is wrapped, I'll cover it with soil. I'm breaking up a piece of old concrete to create an area on one end of the pipe where the water from my driveway can infiltrate into the pipe. Then I cover the drainage area with another layer of weed block and then a layer of mulch. Now we're ready to put in the bed. Note that I've got a two by eight on one end to help address the slope. Now that the bed is completed, we're gonna add the soil. Now I've got this nice pile of screened soil, but before I put it in the garden, I'm gonna add manure, and that's gonna help add nutrients and make this really excellent gardening soil. Now that the soil's in, I'm gonna add one last layer of manure across the whole top of the garden. And then I'm gonna cover that with a layer of newspaper. And here's why. Earthworms love layering in the soil. As they work their way up through the guard bed, they'll come up to that newspaper, hit that layer, and turn around and go back down. But while they do that, they're gonna be grabbing that top layer of manure and working it back down through the soil for me. Over the newspaper, I'll add a layer of leaves. Well, we're done with this bed. A nice thick coat of leaves will help insulate the soil as everything kind of settles in, uh, ready for spring planting. Growing your garden, that's just another easy way to be green. Our mission is to show you simple ways that you can make your life a little greener and how you can save money by doing it yourself helping you see green so you can be green. And as an added benefit, save a little green. Thanks for watching. Please like and share and subscribe for a first look at our new videos.